Okay, so I'm back with just another quick little review, unscripted thing. Uh, but I watched this movie called Turning Red last week, and I thought it was very good. And I thought I would make a quick little video to give basically just an announcement that this movie is good. And I enjoyed it and recommend it to you, the viewer. This is just going to be a really quick thing, probably not more than a couple minutes, but just bear with me. So this is the new Disney Pixar Jam. I know it's out on Disney Plus because that's where I watched it. I don't know if it's in theaters. Um, I, I can't imagine this wouldn't really go over well theatrically, but maybe it's just a Disney Plus thing. Um, I think that it's probably one of the better Disney Pixar things that I've seen in a while. Um, I didn't really like Soul. I didn't like, um, what was the other one? I don't remember, but sing to <laughs> but yeah it was kind of a surprise how much i ended up enjoying it um i thought it was really well made and it had a good style both to the animation as well as to the filmmaking which is the main one for me um i'm glad that i mean obviously it's a disney pixar thing the animation is going to be good because they're pouring you know millions of dollars into it of course it's going to look good but um, unlike some of the other stuff, I think that there was a strong uh, like filmmaking presence behind it. Um, there was like an actual voice um, and style to the animation, as well as to the actual camera and camera movements, the editing. It was um, nowhere near as perfect as the masterpiece that is the Mitchells vs. the Machines. But um, I think that for a Disney Pixar safe little thing, uh, I think it's a very good, very good move in the, the right direction because I think every time I was, oh, Encanto, that was the other one. I think it was like every time I'm watching a, a new Disney thing, like, I, I mean, obviously I'm not the target demographic, but it just seems like they're getting uh, increasingly lazy the, the, in both in the stories and the um, filmmaking aspects. It's just very formulaic, basic, and um, I think this is a good... Um, I don't even know return. I don't really I mean, it's just it was solid and I think that's mainly because it comes from an actual filmmaker with an actual voice an actual thing to say um, This is an actual story and not just a thing to to sell a soundtrack and to emotionally manipulate you because they've gotten a perfect formula and they're gonna pour 10 million dollars into a thing that will trick you into crying at the end and I think that this really uh, took a step past that and actually told a story. And obviously with that um, is a bunch of weirdos that uh, are making, trying to turn this into a controversy, a big, oh, oh, oh me oh my, I can't let my, my child watch this movie because, because I don't, I don't, I don't like turning red. That's scary. That's a scary movie. And you shouldn't shouldn't you shouldn't do that yeah i think that i was kind of um taken aback by how much i enjoyed it um it's not to say that it wasn't formulaic but i think that it deviated enough from it and had enough um actual emotion in it that it really was effective in a lot of the things that it tried to do and say um it was a very funny movie i i mean i was laughing um, like, I mean, obviously the humor's not meant for me, and I wasn't laughing as if it was like, oh, this is really funny. It was like, I'm laughing like, oh, that's a joke in a kid's movie. I don't want to blow my brains out because of it. And, you know, that's, that's the standard, I think, at this point. So I think, um, very cool, uh, you know, I think that it sort of, not that it subverted my expectations, but, um, it kind of... Uh, went beyond what I was expecting with a lot of the things that it did and actually was kind of smarter than I thought it was going to be even when I was like on board with it it kind of kept going further and I think it, it built up a lot of goodwill and by the ending I was really like emotionally invested like I, I felt kind of emotional by the ending of an animated movie and that is a very uh, rare thing um, not to comment on animation or the kids' movies, but recently they are um, much lower effort and much uh, less intelligent and clever. Um, but this was very good, highly recommend. Uh, not as good as Mitchell's vs. the Machines, which is the, the most amazing thing 
ever put on Netflix. Uh, but yeah, I don't really have much else to say other than that. Um, this is a very quick overview. This is not a review. This is a public service announcement to go and watch this movie because I think the more people that watch it, uh, the more that it will get promoted and the more it will um, upset the people that are upset by this movie's existence, which I think is very funny and very cool. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. Um, we're kind of in unofficially, officially doing weekly uploads type meme. Uh, hopefully next week will be a Sundance thing. That's going to be um, more scripted but less edited. So uh, let's see if I can do that for next week. Um, I want to try to use this channel more in the coming months, perhaps. And I think that's going to be it. What? Do you thought you were expecting a full video? You're expecting a good video? You're expecting something that I had planned out? I have a Google Doc open, but it's literally blank. All I have written is one thing, and it was a bit that I scrapped. I was going to open the video by, like, making a joke, like, oh, we're going to be talking about a film with a color, and then I was going to hold up, get, th get this, I was going to hold up my Blu-ray of three colors blue, because it's, like, the opposite of the, like, red. Um, but I realized I just, I'm so low energy right now. I didn't even have like any charisma or like, um, energy to like have like a bit or like a misdirection and like have the bit like pull off. So I ended up, I'm just staring at a blank Google document. You expect me to put effort into my videos? You expect, you expect me to do things other than watch movies and log them on letterbox? Clearly, clearly. You don't understand the Sir Chancellor style. I'm gonna spend hours editing this, even though it's 15 minutes long. Yeah, what are you gonna do about it? You, I, I know what you're gonna do. You're gonna go watch Turning Red because, or I actually just forgot the name of the movie. It is Turning Red. I thought it was, <laughs> I thought it was Don't Turn Red. Don't look up. Don't, 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 don't turn red. That's the name of the movie. Um, that's the moral of the film. That's the moral of the video. Don't turn red. Uh, I'm, I don't know. Should I try and do the opening bit? Like, we're gonna, today we're gonna talk about a color movie. Blue! Haha, <laughs> no, red. Is that what you want? Is that, is that what you wanted? Is that what you wanted? Turn the video off. Turn the video off. I'm done. I'm actually